When a person commits the first sin, he might feel shy. And after a while, other people commit sins. And then this person openly commits sins. This is why the hadith says people will continue to remain in goodness. Remain in goodness meaning there is hope for them. For as long as they do not openly commit sin. So if someone closes the door, they privately commit sin. It means they don't want to expose it. They are shy. They are ashamed. And they don't want to expose themselves. The hadith says there is a greater chance of such, such a person achieving the forgiveness of Allah than there is for a person who openly commits it. You don't even bat an eyelid. People are committing adultery on the street and nobody even bats an eyelid. That is dangerous. So the going away of modesty. If you are not ashamed or if you don't have any modesty, you're not shy in any way, then you're going to do whatever you want, isn't it? Whether it's right or wrong doesn't bother you. My brothers and sisters, I tell you why this is such a dangerous crime. And it's such a dangerous effect of the crime that is committed in this way. Because we are encouraging others to do the same. You know, if you encourage people to sin, just like you are sinning, sometimes you might say, I didn't encourage them. The very fact that you committed the sin in public has already encouraged them. That's what it is. Why do you want your name to go down in the books that you were a person who taught people how to sin? Why doesn't, why don't you think for a moment that I'm going to die rather leave a legacy whereby my name goes down that I am going to be, I'm a person who actually taught people how to do good. And the sins I had, and we are all sinful, by the way, we all commit sins on different levels. None of us can say we are perfect, but we are talking of the effects so that by listening to them, we feel like turning back. That's the idea. Let's not be people who are shameless. And if we find ourselves being shameless and we realize it, perhaps it would be a bonus in the sense that we would be able to leave that, quit it and go back to modesty. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala strengthen us.